this is how running office is like. This is a reverse. Um, basically, uh, this trail was hand built by a few expats. Um, one of them is uh, fondly known as uh, Flintstone, which is a personal friend of mine. Um, it's hard to believe that he's been here for almost 20 years working. Um, made uh, Bukit Kiara Trail almost his second home and uh, what is happening now is that the government of the day is planning to turn uh, this whole place here as you can see uh, into a big parking lot a multi-story parking lot in the residential area of Kamantun Exactly. So it makes you wonder if um, we have priorities over uh, green lung within a city setup like this, or do we envision to see parks like this? Turn into another Gunting Island, another um, Legoland with uh, fast food stores um, on your left and right. Is that what we want? Think about it. Uh, on my last 1km of the run today, um, I've clocked about 5.5 exit exit uh, around any bypasses now. So I'm expecting uh, somewhere about 6.5, 7 by the time I reach the park again. I'm trying to get it complete within an hour. Uh, because my son has a class in a park uh, and that's how my workout and my wife's workout um, center around the family there's a park or the park that has a uh, quite a good population of uh, Jungle file and trying to find for you. Perhaps not today. There you go. This one somewhere there. Let's chase some chicken. Now, if you catch that, fry it. Now, that's fried chicken for you. You have to work for your food. Um, chicken in this kind of uh, condition, feeding off the what we call the pasture. Uh, is by far the healthiest because chicken are opportunistic uh, feeder they will eat anything they can find plants included and uh, that's one of the reason uh, there's a market for chicken uh, the so-called clean that is actually Raised up in an environment like this, uh, fed some grains uh, and let loose in a pasture like this. So, if someone tried to sell you a clean chicken, a grass fed chicken, uh, it's not really grass fed, 
but it's a race in pasture. It's two different things, eh? Okay? Have about. What little is that? Not too big. Or two feet. Awesome, Kiara. So you saw chicken today. Uh, you saw monitor lizard, and you saw a man running topless because I forgot to bring a spare shirt. <laughs> yeah, excuse. Almost there. I'm uh, pushing at 81% or oh, 165 just right above my lactate threshold which essentially meant the stage where my uh, muscle starts to get tired and lactic acid is being formed limiting the ability to push more so uh, uh, 169 a trained athlete uh, has fairly high lactate threshold uh, he comes in very late in their sports, allowing them to maximize their athletic potential. So all this training that I'm putting in is to raise my lactate threshold um, and also to make me technically a little bit uh, stronger uh, racing training and uh, putting everything in life I'm done this is the cross junction it goes from the park connector carnival and to Tamantun Park so let's not slow down yet let's finish run because that's what we are here for well, apart from listening to me talk I'm sure you guys enjoy it hearing a naked man hyperventilating yeah no lame okay so until you see me again in life or in uh, YouTube or in my blog train hard stay safe and keep moving forward six point five.